Great. Um, and then lastly, I'd like to know how Capitol Police handle um, equipment that belongs to a member or a staffer that's been lost within the Capitol complex and found or recovered by one of your officers. What happens? Sure. Well, it's processed on, a, on, a, on a, what's called a PD-81, which is a, which is a, a, a property record. And depending on the property, depending on how it's, if you can legitimately uh, determine ownership, then uh, it's generally turned back over to the, to the owner of the property. If there's, if, if it's part of, uh, of an ongoing case, then there are other things that have to occur for that to happen. So if a member says that they have equipment that's been lost and you find it, it would be returned to the member? In the general sense, yes. Okay. Has to, you have to identify, you have to be able to positively identify the property and be able to establish ownership. Right, and, and if ownership is established. If it's part of an ongoing case, then there are additional things that need to be done. But if the member owns the equipment and there is no ongoing case related to that member, then the equipment is supposed to be returned. Right, in, 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 in a general sense, yes. If no, I mean in a specific sense. If the member loses the equipment, says they lose the equipment, yes, and it is found by the Capitol Police, it is supposed to be returned. If ownership has been established, right. it'll be returned. If it's subject uh, to an ongoing investigation, there are additional things okay. that need to be turned But over. not an ongoing investigation related to the member. If the equipment belongs to the member, it has been lost, they say it's been lost and it's been identified as that member's, then the Capitol Police is supposed to return it, correct? Well, it's not a, I can't give a yes or no answer on that because I know It's a simple yes or no answer. Well, if, you lo if, if, I, if a member loses the equipment yes, and it is found by the Capitol Police or your staff and it is identified as that member member's equipment and the member is not associated with any case and that is their equipment, it is supposed to be returned, yes or no? Depends on the circumstances. Uh, and if the circumstances I, are... I, I don't understand how that's possible. Members equipment is members equipment that is not it is not it, under my understanding the Capitol Police is not able to confiscate members equipment when the member is not under investigation it is their equipment and it's supposed to be returned well I think there's extenuating circumstances in this case and I think I think that you know working through my counsel and um, you know the necessary personnel if, if that in fact is the case and with the permission of through the investigation and we'll return the equipment but until that's accomplished I can't return the equipment I think you're violating the rules when you when you conduct your business that way and should expect that there would be consequences I yield back gentlemen thank you for your testimony today Chief.